All right, good morning, everyone. Welcome to the Committee on Land Use. I am Council Member Rafael Salamanca, Chair of this, of this committee. <clears throat> Today we've been joined by our esteemed colleagues. We have Council Members Constantinides, Chair Kalos, King, Miller, Reynoso, Richards, Torres, Traeger, Grudenchik, Chair Adams, Diaz, Chair Moya, and Rivera. Today we'll be voting on applications referred out of our three subcommittees. We will vote to approve LUs 238, the 238 President Street House, and LUs 239, the Hans S. Christian Memorial Kindergarten, two historic landmarks designations by the Landmark Preservation Commission located in Carroll Gardens neighborhood in Brooklyn, represented by Councilmember Lander. We will vote to approve with modifications LUs 256, the DOT Brooklyn Fleet Service application. This application pursuant to section 197-C of the New York City Charter is for the site selection and acquisition of property located at 2514 Street in Brooklyn for a fleet vehicle maintenance and repair facility. Because DOT has committed to exploring sustainable energy systems in this building, our modification will clarify and ensure that this site is for a DOT fleet, not another agency's fleet. This site is also in Council Member Landers District. We will vote to approve LUs 278, an application filed by the School Construction Authority for the siting of a 456 seat in, in intermediate intermediate high school facility pursuant to section 1732 of the public authorities law and the SCA seeks approval to construct this building at 715 Ocean Terrace in Councilmember Matteo's district in Staten Island. From our zoning subcommittee, we will vote to approve LUs 267, an application by TNS Restaurant LLC for a renewal of a revocable consent to operate an enclosed sidewalk cafe at Gracie's on Second Diner located 300 East 86th Street in Councilmember Kalos District in Manhattan. We will also vote to approve LUs 268, an application from KKND of 79th Street Restaurant Corporation DBA Nectar Cafe for renewal of a revocable consent to operate an unenclosed sidewalk cafe located at 1022 Madison Avenue in Councilmember Powell's District in Manhattan. From our planning subcommittee, we will vote to approve OUs 257 Clinton URA site in Speaker Johnson's District in Manhattan, approval of a new tax exemption pursuant to Article 11 of the Private Housing Finance Law will facilitate the completion of a project at 540 West 53rd Street, consisting of a one residential building with 103 affordable dwelling units, over 20,000 square feet of commercial space, and about 2,500 square feet of open space. We will vote to approve LUs 258 at 590 Southern Boulevard in Councilmember Ayala's district in the Bronx. Approval of this tax exemption pursuant to Article 11 of the Private Housing Finance Law will facilitate the preservation of a 27-unit HDFC co-op that has been a candidate for the third-party transfer round 10. HBD pulled the building from the third-party transfer because of the progress that the HF HDFC board has made towards resolving many outstanding issues. HPD is seeking a new full tax exemption to address the outstanding real estate tax arrears. We will vote to approve the OU's 265 JOE Central Brooklyn, an application pursuing Article 11 of the Private Housing Finance Law for tax exemptions applying to a jointly owned portfolio of 79 residential buildings in Bedford Stuyvesant and Brownsville neighborhoods in Brooklyn. These buildings containing a total of 525 units of rental housing for low income families are in districts of Council Member Levin, Combo, Carnegie, Apri Samuels, and Barron. We will vote to approve OUs 266. 464-68 West 51st Street, which consists of two five-story buildings providing 11 units of home ownership buildings for low-income families in Clinton neighborhood of Manhattan and Speaker Johnson's district. This is an application by HPD for a 30-year tax exemption pursuant to Article 11 of the Private Housing Finance Law. We will also vote to approve LU279 Victory Plaza for property located at 3-11 West 118th Street and 1460-1472 Fifth Avenue in Councilmember Perkins District in Manhattan. Approval of this application for an amendment to a previously approved Urban Development Action Area project will facilitate the development of a new nine-story, 135-unit, 100% affordable residential building for seniors. 30% of these units are reserved for formerly home for formerly homeless households. Are there any questions or remarks from members of the committee? 
All right, seeing none, I will now call a vote in accordance with the recommendations of the subcommittees and the local council members to approve LUs 238, 239, 257, 258, 265, 266, 267, 268, 278, and 279, and to modify LU 256. Will the clerk please call the roll? Lee Martin, community clerk, roll call vote committee on land use. Chair Salamanca. Aye on all. Lanceman. Aye. Gibson. Constantinides. Aye on all. Deutsch. Aye on all. Kalos. Aye on all. King. Aye on all. Miller. Aye. Reynoso. But I on all. Richards. Aye on all. Torres. Aye on all. Traeger. Aye. Gordenchik. Adams. Aye. Diaz. Aye. Moya. Aye on all. Rivera. Aye on all except for land use number 279. I abstain. My husband is the Director of Operations and Council at Camber Properties, LLC. Barron. Aye on all with the exception of 257, on which I am abstaining. By a vote of 18 in the affirmative, zero on the negative, and no abstentions, all items on today's agenda are adopted, with land use items 257 and land use item 279 are adopted by the committee, 17 in the affirmative, zero on the negative, and one abstention. All right, I would like to thank members of the public, my colleagues, council, and line staff for attending today's hearing. We will leave the roll open for 10 minutes.